This is the Herman. Sur this is the Herman. This is the Herman Survivor bison. This is the Herman Survivor bison. This is the Herman Survivor's bison boots. If you're looking to buy some working boots, steel toe, waterproof, leather, leatherette. This is my first impression review. Good morning, people. This is Gil Sorgera. If you're new to the channel, this is uh, Jimmy Gilly Life, where I just vlog about anything. Daily vlogging, reviews, basically anything that comes into my life. My wife bought me some stuff. I don't know if you see that. In a sign of my own. Or in uh, Messiah people. Uh, oh, yeah. It's not healthy, but tastes great. I mean, for me, I like it. I got my 1.5 right here. I drink two of these in one day, all right? I've been looking for new boots. As you can see in my other video, the, my boots tore. I, bought, I picked up a pair of boots. I just want to review them real quick. All right, you see it, Herman. I don't know if you can see it, Herman Survivor. As you can see, it's a uh, steel toe, waterproof. It's uh, oil resistant and it's a slip resistant uh, sole. So these boots I bought for, there's my uh, receipt. Walmart, 69 bucks. Wood tax, $73. Not that bad. The ones I bought previous were like $20, $30, $40. So I just wanna see how these hold up. A little bit of information about Herman's. It says here, as you can see right there, you can read that for a quick second. They said they've been around since um, the 18, 1879. These are the features of the boot. All right, I don't know if you see that. They're waterproof, steel toe. Oil resistant. Now, the reason why I got these boots and I got them a little high is because, you know, I'm in for right now, I'm in pest control. So, you know, I need something that is chemical and, uh, you know, waterproof, but more essentially more chemical resistant. And anything getting into my feet, my skin, and um, steel toes in case things drop on my feet. And as well as I need a little bit higher, the, the, um, the cuff. You know, sometimes I go into the bushes, you know, I don't want nothing sticking me and things like that. Fleas, ticks, a lot of stuff there, man. So I'm gonna take them out. You know, when I first saw these, the top of these looked like cowboy boots. My father had crazy snakeskin cowboy boots when I was growing up. This part looks like a cowboy boot. If I just showed you this, you think it's cowboy boot. There's a logo, I guess that's a bear. Right there, Herman's. First impressions, they feel great, or they look great. The inside of them is, um, I think it's water wicking. It looks like it's water wicking. I love that new uh, shoe smell. For some reason, it's like a new car smell. I got nine and a half. This is a sole. I mean, these look like they're gonna last. I will probably end up scratching these right here. That's, that's normal. It doesn't look like it will break too easily from the seam. Here, we'll see what happens. But other than that, yes, yeah, you pick them up. I mean, they're, they're nice and high. I'm gonna wear them, I'll walk around with them. I'll do a little catwalk thing for you. Show you a better fit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a real quick one, but before that, I'm going to show you what I had prior to this, right? These are clean. They're on the table, but these are clean. I haven't worn these yet. These are all touching the table. They're dirty. These are the ones I am coming from. They're also steel toe. I like them high like this, but they left a mark on my leg. I'll show you. Maybe because I have thick legs, right? So watch. I don't know if you see that. They left like a like a permanent, not per. I hope not permanent mark on my leg. But what ended up happening was because of the bending and I think I hit a bush, the, the rubber here is too thin. It cut into right there. And then look at this guy, look at that right there. Oh, and this one, this one was even worse. It was flapping in the wind. Look at this one right here. Oh, I touched it. <laughs> look at that. Oh, that's nasty. 
garbage. These are Interceptor, these are my first set, Interceptor boots. Definitely not, it's not waterproof. It, it, it water got into it. I was walking wet feet all day. And then um, in the seat of soles here, right up in here, we're slowly cracking and separating. So, you know, I had to change it up. So I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm gonna put these boots on. Cowboy slip on, boom. I'm just doing it, that's my niece Abby. But you can see, <laughs> bending wise, I might see an issue here. We'll see what happens around this area here. Like bending, squatting. We'll see what happens with the leather, if it pinches and things like that. I'll give you a long term review in the next couple, oh man. <laughs> next couple of weeks, we'll see what happens. That's my short first impression review of my uh, Herman Survivors, the Bison model. Please smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and click that bell so you can always catch new videos that I'm doing. Uh, take care, I'll see you.